let's drop the save because I think we've done quite a bit. Um, let's, let's think about this. Uh, oh god, there's so much now already. Just looking at this. Find schematics for a new power grid and deliver them. Okay, um, do we... Look who's here. So what's on your mind, Shepard? Well, that's probably just... I know where to find you. I'll be in touch. We'll be seeing each other soon, Shepard. Okay. Well, if they're all here on the... Wait. Well, they're all, they're on the Cyrodiil, so let's do them over here, we might as well. Right. Now, I don't know how we're going to break that person out of jail, though. I don't see how we're going to do that. Bailey's not going to do spit. Welcome, Commander Shepard. Please select a destination. Nowhere to go. <laughs> City and Commons, okay. Welcome, Let's go there first. I'll do the prison Please thing last, because I don't know. <laughs> I don't know how, how that's going to work. Now arriving at Presidium Commons. Oh, wait. Where are we going? So now is this way. Have you decided how to tell him? I don't know. A text message is so important. Here he is. Quick, hands behind your back. We'll be here any minute. It's Pateria. What the hell are you talking about? Crete, Blood Pack's leader. Aria brings him the Greek commander Shepard. Crete pledges the game to her. We're just luring him into the open so we can take him out. Not the best start to our friendship, Narl. Huh. He's coming. Put your hands behind your back and uh, try to look like I beat you up or something. This better be on the up and up. Mm. Quiet. <laughs> I am to look even more powerful than Crick thought. Her instructions on boarding Citadel undetected were one thing. It's obviously the same species from Omega, but is it the same people? Commander Shepard want you to know your head will be hood ornament on my personal shuttle. <laughs> Keep your distance, Creed. So, do you agree to Arya's terms? <sighs> Most definitely. Arya can use blood pack as she sees fit. Shoot him in the face. Wasn't talking <laughs> to you, Creed. Grill. What? You have my word. Now open fire! Huh? Not him. Grill's next in line to take over. Arya's deal is with him. Yes. Yes. I'm Arya's mole, Shepard. Oh, okay. You've scratched my back. Now I'll scratch yours. Huh. Word of advice. Don't double-cross Arya. I may be ambitious, but I'm not crazy. <laughs> uh huh. Good work, Narl. Thanks for the gun. <laughs> Anytime, Shepard. Grill and I will let Arya know the light is green. That was easy. <laughs> that was easy. Wow. Okay. Our refugee camp. Let's go there. Well, that was easy. <laughs> I'll take it. It's the prison one I'm worried about because I don't know if Bailey's gonna. Well, Bailey might do, but I guess we'll see. 
We might as well do these while we're on the server. We might as well just do those. And once we've done this, I'll probably go and gather a couple of the uh, collectibles that are needed. Uh, let's see. Where's this guy? Number five. Right at the end, and turn right. There he is. Wow. Arya wasn't kidding. The great Commander Shepard on a leash. <laughs> I'm here for my own reasons, Vosk. Oh, sure you are. Anyway, tell her I'm impressed, but to do business, I still need my little problem taken care of. Which is? A Torian general named Oraka has it out for the Blue Suns. He's raising a stink over our activity in this sector. I'll commit my gang to Arya as soon as Oraka's dead. There must be more to Oraka's complaint. We're just making little raids along trading routes. With Arya's blessing, I might add. Huh. Oraka's just some military fossil who came out of retirement to relive the glory days and justify his existence. Losing him won't affect your war in the least, but gaining the Blue Suns, well, you know our work. You seriously think I'll assassinate a Turian general? Arya seems to think so. Or else, why would she send you? She knew the price. The two of you work it out. Oh, and, uh... <laughs> tell Arya I still expect her blue ass in bed with me. <laughs> wow. What is it, Shepard? You knew about this? Can you be more specific? Darner Vosk expects me to kill General Oraka. Who cares what Vosk wants? What he needs is for Oraka to stop disrupting his operations. I figured you'd talk to Oraka, see if you can get him to lay off. And if he won't listen to reason, call me, and I'll take care of him. I don't see the distinction. <laughs> the distinction is that I'm giving you the chance to save his life. Right. Why didn't you just tell me this yourself? <laughs> That's fair. Plus, if I have to suffer that scumbag staring at my tits one more time, I might have to. <laughs> yeah, he mentioned that uh, yeah. I'm going to sleep with him. We all have our delusions. <laughs> fair enough, he's a jerk. Who cares? Okay, so, oh, we gotta go to a different floor entirely to go get him? Okay. So Rocker sounds familiar. Was he one of the people that uh, I saw when I was Welcome finding out show. everything for you? He sounds familiar now that I think about it. Let's see. Now arriving at I guess it doesn't matter how I do it. I just need to tell him about it. Oh yeah, he's there. Yeah, I remember. I kind of remember this guy. Commander Shepard. He was one of the. General Araka. Missions you had. I think we met in Korra's den. You were pretty miserable, if I recall. Oh, wait. Yes. Neck deep in drink just before I retired. Yeah, this is the I guy we bought the, um... Reinstated. Do you remember that mission in Mass Effect? I hear you're oh, you taking on the Blue Suns. I need to do my part for the Citadel, Commander. The Blue Suns are raiding C-Sec weapons shipments. I'm putting a stop to that. Those mercs are seriously. You probably do actually. Um, its ability to defend itself if the war comes here, when the war comes here. There are other ways to secure weapons, General. You don't think I've tried? There's a black market dealer on Citadel right now, but he won't sell his top line arms. The Reapers are destroying everything in their path, and I can't stop them. But I can stop the Blue Suns. Let me see what I can do for you. I'd appreciate your help, and I'll have a plan of action ready if things fall through. <laughs> he was, um, he's the guy on, was it, was it Ferros? And you had to get like a garage pass. He was one of the people you could do something for. Oh. Yeah. 
Very pitch market for Canic, apparently. Uh, okay, so it's probably up the stairs. Oh, then run away. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm gonna run away. Shit. Yeah, I remember that guy. He's in the market at number six. I'm going the wrong way. God damn it. He is, um... Yeah, he's down here. He's, he's down there, but I... Oh, shit. <laughs> Why do they never make the maps easier to fucking read? <laughs> He's here. Uh, let's see. Welcome to the Citadel gift shop. All proceeds will stay purchased and goes to the Terrain War. There he is. Look, Commander, I don't want any trouble. I'm authorized to sell here, and all my arms are legal. See? <laughs> These are lightweight weapons. Where's your top end inventory? Shit. You slumming for C Sec 2? I already got harassed by the old Turian with the bad attitude. Yeah, I got much better stuff, but it's off the market. Galaxy's going belly up. Credit won't mean anything once the Reapers rip through. So what exactly are you saying? Whatever happens, I figure there'll be survivors, but it'll be chaos. I'm betting things will run on a barter system. <laughs> so I'm getting a jump. My best stock only trades for hard goods. Why are all these like real value. um suspicious dudes? They're all Salarians, aren't they? And like a very suspicious race, you gotta be suspicious of every single one, and they're always doing some shady shit. <laughs> so what gets me access to your top shelf? Heh, <laughs> Turian just waved credits in my face and spat on it. Nice to see you have flexibility. If you find any rare pieces when you're out saving the galaxy, bring them back. Then I'm happy to share my top stock with C-Sec, no problem. Outside of that, I gotta stick to my guns. Okay. Credits don't talk with me, Commander. C-Sec wants my top of the line. You gotta come through with a couple artifacts. Okay. So what does that mean? Uh... I can't actually access it to find out where I need to go for that. Oh wait, he, he says, he's just C-Sec, right? Uh, hmm. Do, do I talk to him again? Unless you can find a new source of weapons for CSEC, I'm putting together a task force to stop the Blue Suns myself. Okay. I'll get you your weapons, General. I appreciate the effort, but I've spent too much time out of action, Commander. Won't be able to sit on my hands much longer. Huh, okay. Um...
Uh, I don't want to do that, but never mind. Hey, I remember you. Shepherd, right? Heard you're fighting the Reapers. Matriarch Athena. You were working on Ilium. How'd you end oh. up here? Uh, yeah, I remember the her. Reapers I think. making noise. I figured it was time to get somewhere safer. So I moved here. I don't think so. I've seen some video footage of you looking at Liara. No. Yeah. Uh. Mm. Matriarch Benazio was, um... Wait, what? Was her mother. And Am I reading this right? Well, she doesn't know it, but... I was her father. What the fuck? You mean you were her other mother, right? No, I didn't pop her out. Hell, she's never even met me. Sorry, if you were human, you'd both be called the mother. Regardless of which one gave birth. <laughs> well, I'm not human, am I? Anthropocentric bag of dicks. <laughs> Liara would love to meet you. Why? She doesn't even know me from a hole in the ground. Venezia ran off before the kid was born. Besides, this isn't charity work. She's one of the biggest intel brokers in the galaxy. I mean, yeah. And she's got some shady connections. Like a girlfriend who used to work for Cerberus. I only worked with Cerberus to fight the Reapers. And you're not with him now. I know. If you were, you wouldn't get within a light year of Liara. I didn't romance her at Army 1. I'm no commando, but I've had a thousand years to learn to fight dirty. Nobody messes with my girl. Anyway, you combine her work with Venezia and... Well, the matriarchs might have ordered a hit. I hadn't agreed to keep an eye on her. I bet she'd like to meet you. Yeah. We'll see how that goes. Well... Shit! That's... that's wild. I don't know whether we tell her about it. That bartender over there? The matriarch hired by the Asari government to track my movements? She's your father. I know. What? You know oh yeah, me. she's... I'm a very good information broker. Yeah. And you haven't talked to her about spying on you? If I did that, they might send someone who wasn't as sympathetic to me. Besides, this is hardly the time for family reunions. Liara. Oh, fine. <laughs> well, I've learned something new here today. <laughs> Shit! Sorry, second fleet, though. Come on. Can't blame the matriarchs for keeping an eye on you. I am not my mother. You did threaten to flay someone alive with your mind. <laughs> I had to make them take me seriously. I wasn't going to actually do it. Mm -hmm. And you bugged my office on Ilium. That'd be the logical conclusion. Yeah. So the only thing I don't really know what to do at the moment is um. The only one I don't really know how to do is this, um, That's a core mission. That's the one that bugged me the most. Oh, really? Yeah, because I couldn't figure out fucking either. It took me fucking ages. Oh, my God. <clears throat> I, guess it, I guess it's the planet scanning thing. So, we might as well leave that one and try this one. Uh, Bailey. Oh wait, do you think... Welcome to Kanala Exports. Thank you for shopping at Kanala Exports. Welcome to Elkos Combine Arsenal Supplies. Please visit any of our Elkos Combine... Special requisition board? Do you reckon? Worth a try? Yeah, that might have it. We're heading that way anyway, so... Welcome, Commander Shepard. Please select the destination. Here. One moment, 
I forget where everything is. Yeah, that might be the only thing we get to do, actually, now that I think about it. So let's try that. Yeah, the Spectral Requisitions Terminal might help here. So let's see if we can do that. Here it is. Let's see. Uh, there's nothing here at the moment. I'm sure we'll probably come across it at some point. I hope. Let's do this thing with Bailey. Let's see what we have to do. I just Shepherd, bored for the door. Why all the pleasure? Here to talk to you about releasing Jonas Adaris. Damn, you too. Somebody got the council to order her release. I'm delaying as best I can. What's your stake in this? It's classified. No. That's a fancy way of saying mind your own business. <laughs> Look, there's no way I'm letting that psychopath out. The woman's unstable and a clear public threat. What makes you think she's crazy? She was a ruthless sadist before she got caught. Her imprisonment has cracked a shell off the nut. Hmm. <laughs> Maybe freedom will improve her. She rages day and night, Shepard, calling mm. for the deaths of all Eclipse enemies. Oh, God. <laughs> no, freedom will only give her the chance to kill. Yeah. I'd like access to her to judge for myself. Sure thing. I'm sure you'll agree. Then maybe the Council will listen to you and rescind the order. Go to the C-Sec outpost. My assistant will connect to Sedera's cell from there. Then call me back. Okay. Back to the uh, Presidium comms again. <laughs> yeah, I'm noticing that. Yeah. <laughs> well, at least it's fast loading. So that's a plus. Don't show much activity from the Asari military against the Reapers. Come on. I'm Riley. I think it's like right at the end here. As if it's not. So, hang on. I want to put this guy once again. Weapons, right? Credits don't talk with me, Commander. C-Sec wants my top of the line. You gotta come through with a couple of artifacts. All right, okay. Oh my god. Why? More fetch. <laughs> god. I've connected with Jonas Sedaris and her cell, Commander. You can speak with her via that console. Thanks. We'll need some privacy. Of course. When you're done, you can also contact Commander Bailey from that terminal. Oh, okay. Well, that makes that easy. Who's not spying on me now? Ah, oh, I see. Good. Arya's indentured servant has finally come to deliver me to freedom. I want to talk with you before I secure your release. Bullshit. You have no choice. And when I get out, heads will roll. Mm. Oh, 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 yes. Right. You've killed a lot of my people. Don't think I've forgotten that. You have to move on. And I will, once all my enemies are dead. I love holding all the cards. Even in here, you must deal with me. I have all the power. Is that right? <laughs> yes. Saying my second in command is a weak willed toady. If he had balls, he'd leave me to rot and take control himself. But he won't defy me. He knows better. Now get me out of here, Shepard. Tell Bailey to release me. Bailey, I've seen Sedaris. 
So she's crazy, right? It would be ridiculous to let her out. She's a menace. Let me try to make this problem go away. Sounds good. I'll hold the line until I hear from you. Hmm. Okay. She did mention someone. I wonder if we could find out where he is or... Yeah, see it, yeah. Holding area. So we're back to the lift. It's gonna be like a home in this game. <laughs> Good lord. Run. <laughs> Like Garrus is, ironically. What about the food we were promised? It's been allocated to the men. Get ready for trouble. Uh oh. Not here for that, Zane. Just want to talk about Jonas Sedaris's release. Oh, you're the one coordinating that, right? My idea, you know. Arya came to me looking to gain Eclipse support. I'm leveraging it to bust the boss out. Saying you should run Eclipse. Huh? You can do it. Leave Sedaris locked up and make the deal with Arya yourself. Huh. Hmm. Arya would be a step up. And you think she'd let me run things? I don't see why not. Right. Right. Then that's the plan. Keep Sedaris in jail. I'll call Arya right away. Sweet. Good man. <laughs> Sweet. So, the last thing we need to do is get those artifacts from somewhere. Uh, I'm not really sure how we're going to do that, honestly. So, I guess one thing we can do is we can finally go back to Normandy, for goodness sake. <laughs> probably grab a couple of things that we can already get because I can get a couple of um, I can get a couple of the collectible things that I need I think Cortez is somewhere around here, so we can talk to him over here. Now arriving at Docking Bay D24. So you're just saying that the night. You finally made it off the Normandy. Glad I did. Even with the chaos of all the refugees, seeing so many ships in flight is comforting. Gets me thinking. Hey, a Turian frigate. I think that's the PFS Havenkal. What's one Turian warship doing at the Citadel? Looking for dry dock, I bet. She's seen battle. Look at the waiver in her drive core emissions. Alone, limping, looking for a haven. Maybe it would have been better to just go down fighting, like their families back home. Are you talking about the Turians or yourself? I should have been there. With Robert. But you weren't. You're alive. And that's a good thing. Maybe so. The lives of future generations rest on those Turian shoulders. On our shoulders. Nobody's given up. Not those Turians. Not me. Not you. If anyone can pull this all together, it's you. Is that an Alliance cruiser? What's it doing here? That's the SSV London. Decommissioned years ago. Huh. No guns. 